Hey Aries, how you going? Welcome to your weekly tarot reading. We're doing next week, so September 20th until September 26th. And it's just going to give us some guidance and insight into what you can expect for next week, Aries. Okay, Aries. So straight up, you're the, this week you're going to be going into a shift in a whole new direction. Okay, You've, you're going to need to close the door on one thing in order to open up the door to something totally new. Okay, and that may involve taking a risk. It may involve stepping outside your comfort zone and doing something where it's really speculative. Okay, so and that might go against you, Aries, because obviously you like planning. You like structure, you like to know what you're doing, how you're doing it, and to have everything planned out, all right? But this week, the overall feeling for the week is you kind of need to go against that areas, all right? You kind of need to just take that risk and give in to something, all right? Because you're not going to be able to plan out every little part of this week, and you're just going to need to go with that, okay? Um, but like I said, you've also got the, you've got the death of one thing in order to open up something else. Else, okay so whatever that ending is it's going to be a necessary ending it's it's like a natural change and you're not going to be able to avoid it all right so whatever the ending is coming you know this whole week is going to be about you evolving into that next phase and that next change okay now we'll have a look at what we've got going on on Monday for you Aries All right, so Monday's assuring you that whatever journey you've been on lately, whatever the change is that's coming, all right, it may be a bit rough for you, but you're going to get that happy outcome from it, all right? You're going to get that happy ending from it. But you are going to need to be aware, where Aries, that you may, it, it's not going to be like this. Maybe whatever this change is I was talking about, whatever it is where you've got to step in and just take that risk and give in to it, whatever that is is it's obviously it's not just going to be done and finished like that okay it will be a bit of a journey but it's not going to be forever and it's not going to be too long so you know you're going to get to the end of it soon you're just going to need to keep continuing and again like I said it's it's that happy, it's all going to be worth it. It's all going to be for your happiness and it's all going to come back around tenfold, okay? So even though you do have this big change and you do have this like, think of it kind of like a natural evolution, okay? And like I said, because you are needing to close the door on one thing, sometimes that, that can be hard. Sometimes it can be difficult, okay? Especially because you're such faithful people, you know? So what you want to do though is is just go with it, all right? Because whatever you do need to close the door on, that's what's then, that's necessary. It's like imperative for you to be able to start that new beginning, to start that that whole new cycle again, all right? And like I said before, sadly, you're not going to be able to control it, okay? Or actually, it's only sadly if you're not wanting the change. But regardless, it's going to be out of your hands, Aries, okay? And you are just going to have to go with it because it is going to be the death of something in order to start something else again, all right? Now, we'll go in to Tuesday for you, Aries. All right, so Tuesday has you striving forward, and it's got you striving forward to uh, uh, a successful day, all right? Whatever you want to do on Tuesday, like whether it be work, whether it be some creative outlet, it's like just go for it, all right? Just dive straight into it, Aries, because you are very creative. You're very imaginative. That's just you as, as, as a people, you know? So, Aries, it's all about that on Tuesday for you, okay? It's going to be, obviously, because of whatever this change 
changes, that creativity, it's an outlet for you, okay? For some of you, it might even put you into that meditative state when you're doing your creative stuff. So that's going to be really, really favoured on Tuesday. And it's going to bring you happiness, okay? It's going to bring you all that good energy. It's going to bring you, it's, it's, it's just going to be... Think of it like food for your soul, okay? So that's going to be your job on Tuesday is like feed your soul, okay? Because you will have this, like I keep saying, you do have this change in this, this evolution above you this week, all right? So you are going to need to just embrace it, embrace all that good energy that comes Tuesday and keep yourself centered and keep yourself happy, all right? And keep yourself focused on whatever your creative outlet is. Okay, now, sorry, flipping cards here. Now, on Tuesday, we've got, you've obviously been in a really happy phase lately, okay? And that's going to continue. That balance and all that is going to continue for you. Now, you've also pulled out the moon. So, we've also got, like, at the same time, beware of a bit of an illusionist, okay? Like I said, you are going into this whole new natural change, you know? You're going into another natural phase. But um, what you're going to want to do is just be wary of someone who promises you too much, okay? Be wary of someone who is keeping secrets from you and all that sort of stuff, okay? Sometimes the moon can hint to to more uh sometimes the moon can hint to uh if if you believe in it it can hint to witchcraft all that sort of stuff but let me just check that's not gonna that's not the issue for you aries okay what the moon's really pointing at is just in regards of your relationships okay like you've been in this happy phase with them but it's also telling you just to have that little bit of caution in there as well okay at the same time keep that caution there and keep in mind that like whatever's not working just leave it behind whatever negativity is in your life just pox put it in that box that's going to be left behind okay that's what you're going to close the door on now thursday aries Let's have a look. Thursday's hinting to me, it's hinting at like it's a day where you really need to nourish your soul, okay? It's going to be a day where you need to take that reflection, take some time and feed that spiritual side of yourself, okay? The main thing for Thursday, the main message coming through to me is that you really just are going to need to nourish your soul on the day. Take that time, meditate, take some time to ground yourself. Maybe there'll be someone who comes into your life on Thursday, you know? maybe that person will be quite spiritual will be a bit of a guru you know if that's the case then take some time take some time with them and learn from that person if they don't cut if that's not a person that comes into your life Aries then it's going to be all about you it's going to be the day where you need to nourish that side of yourself okay and like I said you are closing doors on this old chapter to start the new one so go and find the door to the new chapter you know you've got the key now close the old one and open the new one and the answer for all that is going to be within you so Thursday is going to be all about just looking within yourself Aries okay look within you to find out where where your journey is going to keep progressing where you're going to go next okay you don't have to leave all of it to the complete unknown all right and a lot of the answers are actually already within ourselves now on Friday it's going to be about teamwork okay there's going to be someone that you're going to be work like you're going to be it's going to be with you that day they're going to come into your life that day and they're going to be a bit of a dreamer you know they might be quite flighty and a bit off with the fairies whatever it is your best way forward to on that day is going to be to work with this person okay like favor communication like don't get if they if you get frustrated because they're dreamy or whatever it is just make sure you communicate effectively okay keep yourself grounded don't lose your anger or anything because that's where you might find you'll have a bit of difficulty like if you lose your anger Aries you 
you can be a bit aggressive in that sense. You can laser that a little bit too quickly. You can turn something that could have just been a heated discussion into a bit more of an argument, all right, because you react too quickly. So what you want to do on Friday is make sure you don't do that. Just keep that in your mind and keep Friday all about keeping yourself grounded, keeping yourself centered, and whoever it is that comes into your life on Friday, that's the best way forward for you to deal with them, all right? Now we'll have a look at what you've got going on on Saturday. All right, so Saturday is going to be pretty much it's a bad day about you, Aries, all right? You're going to be feeling like a sense of accomplishment, like you've achieved a lot. Maybe it's to do with this change or maybe it's to do with whatever else has been going on. You know, you have been striving forward for success and all that sort of stuff. So whatever it is, not like Saturday is telling you like this is the day about you, okay? It's the day to celebrate your independence. It's the day to celebrate the fact that you've got everything you need in you. And maybe like I was saying with Thursday, you know, maybe you took that time and you took that time within yourself and you worked some things out because I'm just getting the message on Saturday that it's like it's a day all about you where you've actually found that self-love. You found that reliance on yourself. You found that self-love for yourself. And it's a day to just celebrate that, okay? And like just bask in the joy of everything that comes to you on Saturday Aries because that day really is just going to be about like just bask in the sun really okay enjoy it all now on Sunday you you're gonna be you might find Aries that even though you're a planner. Even though you've planned everything to the T, you may find on Sunday that you're a little bit out of balance, okay? That you're feeling that bit unorganized, disheveled, all that sort of thing, okay? You might find that you've got a couple of things going on at the moment, whether you're juggling priorities or home life or whatever that is. It, it signifies on Sunday you'd be juggling a bit, but you're probably going to be favoring one more than the other, okay? And then that's then going to bother you because you're not going to do anything like a hundred percent okay so what you the cards are telling me on Sunday that as long as you find that balance you can juggle everything that you've got on on the day okay and you'll be able to go forward but what you're going to want to do on that day is accept the help of anyone who's around you okay maybe sometimes you are a bit dismissive and don't accept the help you know or maybe you think you don't need the help but you're going to need to accept that help on Sunday or you might actually need to offer that help to somebody else who is like that, someone else who rejects that help, who doesn't ask for it, but deep down they really need it. So Sunday's just going to be like find that balance and use your mind over your heart. And again, like I was saying, don't, um, don't jump into anything too quickly. Don't get involved into other stuff if it doesn't need you because that little like a bit of aggression isn't going to favor you this week okay you just there's sometimes through the week there may be a few things a few things that are unknown okay you may have just a few things a bit of mystery throughout your week if that's the case just give in to it okay just let, let go give in to it and trust that it's all going to be worth it okay and whatever change whatever evolution does come your way it's all about you this week all right and you need to make that identity identification of what door you're closing and find the new door and just step through it okay take the risk step into the unknown because you're only going to come out of it in a better place okay you're going to come out of it so much better so much happier and it's all going to be worth it Aries okay hopefully that gives you some insight and I'll see you all next week